What's up guys, it's Fearless giving you my second instalment to this series. Hope you enjoyed the first video and if you did then that's great because we're going to jump straight into the highlights from these next matches right now. In these clips I'm just messing around trying to get all the French gear just to add to the French theme. So going into the first match quite confident, just managed to bag Cissé into the team and then this team pops up. Not really what I want to be seeing early on in this series because we all know how overpowered Silver Championship players are in Ultimate Team. But still I was feeling pretty confident. Till it got into the match and then oh my god this team was just all over me. I mean it was just attack after attack after attack. I mean you see him breaking me up here. It's the through balls that are doing me. I mean luckily Zubar was there. My defence is solid in this team. It's just so good. You see me trying to break him through here but it's just a shit through ball from me. I don't know what the hell I was trying. And then again, he's just getting through, getting through, and then I can't believe this, I can't believe you missed this. I was fucking nearly going in, but Zuma just giving me that clearance. And then this is where the magic happens, nice bit of passing. Take it to the fullback CD Bay with a lovely through ball into Berengar, which fucking the first touch is brilliant. And then the cross is beauty, and then BOOM! Cissé in there with the magic header. Uh, just a thing of beauty to see something like that. I can't really play a lot of this with a gold team, but this is fucking beautiful play. Cissé is just working so hard for this team. And then you see him again, getting through, just pushing through, mate, negates all defences, but fucking hits the bar. And then we see Jerome just pushing through, and then the Trump goal. It's lovely to see, isn't it? Yeah, you're telling to calm down, mate. Honestly, it wasn't that great. But yeah, yeah, and then it all goes tits up from here. Just breaking through the middle, I don't know why, I don't usually, like, concede stuff like this, but what the hell is going on there, Jerome? I don't know what this guy's made of, he just dinked it over, dinked over the keeper and just smashes it in the back of the net. I'm going to have to look into these guys' stats because this was just, uh, that was just fucking terrible, look at it, look at it, just fucking all over the place. And then Cissé, body faint, yes, come on, body faint again, yes. Finesse shot, oh, it's just, it's a fucking goal mate, what can you ask for in a strike, what more can you ask for, it's just, it's just working so hard for this team, the skill moves are brilliant, the finishes are brilliant, it's just such a good card to have, you need to try this guy out man, yeah after that goal mate, he's, this guy won't give you up for shit, I mean Jerome is the only real threat in this team, he's just, just pacing it through, where the fuck is my defence, you need to be getting onto that, and then, here we go, 90th minute aids, you'll see, just a second, yeah, fucking dinks it in the court, top, the bottom corner. Uh, I just can see like that too often, I need to fucking stop it, and sadly, it does mean that I do lose, so we have to fucking downgrade, let's just see it again. Oh, uh, it's just fucking Cameron Jerome, there you have it, 3-2, unluckily, got a downgrade. So, having a look around, I'm a bit dubious about what to bloody downgrade. Obviously, nobody wants to downgrade, but we do go with Bella. I'm looking forward to playing with this one, actually. He's uh, not looking too bad. Yeah, he's got that 86 pace, which yeah, I'm looking for in more wingers, man. I need the pace. So, yeah, this team, uh, Italian squad, no bronzes in this one, though, like the first game. A uh, few fuck ups in defence already, as you can see. Don't, that Pooplin, that goalkeeper, is just amazing. Some of the saves are just unreal. Um, yeah, looking at oh, that power header. Oh, Zuma with that power header, you know he's going to be banging them in, but obviously we do hit the hit the post. Um, this opponent's feeling a bit more, it was a bit weaker than the last one, you know, feel like getting through a bit easier. Then, uh, obviously, then there's him getting through a bit easier, and then, then flipping in the post shots, just hitting the post, luckily. They're usually going in. I usually concede them quite a lot, but FIFA gods are with me there. Um, they are just playing a bit of ping pong. I don't know what the hell's happening there. Nothing happened in the first half. Uh, just messing around with the uh, formation. Wanted to try out the, try out the 4 one 2 one 2 which I'm quite comfortable with, just messing around with the players there, making sure everyone's in the right bloody position. You know, we don't win any centre packs, flipping, playing, striker, do we? And this is where it gets interesting. The formation seems to be working, I'm getting through, lovely through ball to Cissé there with the first touch is just so good. 
and then here I just put well, butterfingers is in goal mate I just don't know how that went in but it went in I actually thought it went wide when I saw that and then when I saw it go in the goal I was like how the hell so I've had to play the replay a few times it just hit yeah it just hits under the under the keeper's arm hand so you know I'll fucking take it it's a goal but then obviously this happens to me the aids he gets through and then it's a bang banged in goal straight away 69th minute, crucial interception there. Really enjoying playing with this keeper. It's just, it's just a game changer for me. And then we're just trying to get through. Um, lovely little body fight there, getting us that that free kick that we want. And now this is a thing of beauty from Seaside. You watch this, watch this for a free kick now. It's coming. Now, I wasn't expecting to score this with Mr. Seaside, but I'm in up. Oh, I think I've used L1 for the power. Uh, two and a half bars and BANG! Just fucked it in top bin, Cissé! I just, oh, I went fucking mental when I scored that goal. It just, oh, what, what can I say? Free kicks through Cissé are just, if you hit them just right, they're just, it's just going in. I mean, let's see the replay again. I mean, the dip is just unreal, the keeper's just not even reacting to that. But then, just like the last match, it happens again. Dying moments of the game, opponents pushing me through, and then bang, he just gets this goal there. So, we're making some more substitutes, and I'm thinking of bringing back Ambu 1 as I can, just to give me some more striking options. Um, here you see a lovely bit of play, pass, pass, and then we see the winger running on, give it a shot, it gets blocked, and then top corner. Just the finish, the finishes are really good with this team, it just, they fuck it in the back of the net. It's just beautiful to see that, you know, seeing the, the build up play being successful for once, and then finishes like that, just, just pleases you man. And there we get another, another cheeky free kick we see, so, um, just trying to apply the same amount, probably a bit too much, three bars. Just went wide though, that was going in. And there's this bugger here trying to do a few ball, ball rolls, trying to be cheeky. And then pooping, bang, oh, what a save. I can't do anything wrong with Kitty though, he's just not doing anything wrong there. Lovely little through ball to Verdia, this is what, this is the icing on the cake now. Little cross into backhand boom in the right place at the right time. Keeper's not saving it. There's no, you know, there's, there's, he's an unmarked man in the box. In header, bang, you can't miss from there. Just under the crossbar. I think I might actually convert him into a cam. What a finish. So, since we won that match, we get to upgrade. As you can see from the, the clip, we had a lot of flipping injuries in that match. Bello and uh, uh, Cabana. But yeah, we're just gonna have a look at some. I think we'll have a look at some CDMs. Needs a bit more defence. And uh, then we have a look. Guilavagui. Uh, oh, I can't even pronounce his name, but he's looking like the better CDM at the moment. Not liking that 37 pace, to be honest. But yeah, we go with we go with this guy. Place him in. Welcome to the team. So there you have it, guys. I now have two shiny silvers, which are immune from downgrading. That's great. So the only way is up from here, lads. If you are enjoying the content so far, then smash that like button, subscribe, drop a comment, leave me some feedback, you know that drill. And I've got some more content on the way shortly, so till next time, stay fearless.